Alright, hey guys. Uh, so today I'm gonna be doing texture pack tutorial number two. Um, haven't done one in a pretty long time. My other one had a lot of good feedback. So yeah, thanks so much, guys. So uh, today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to change the resolution and uh, change the hue and saturation. So, but uh, first off, we're gonna be changing the resolution. So first, what you're going to do is you're gonna do Control A. Then control C and then go to image on the top and go to camera size and go to double the pixel size of it is right now. So let's just say it's 64 by 64. You're gonna double that, which equals 128, etc. So I'm just gonna double 32, which equals 64. So just keep on doubling that. Uh, so yeah, so you have this. So now, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna press OK and then press Control V. That paste the image from your clipboard. Uh, you can now uh, press Shift and drag onto this corner right here, and keep on going until all of the white or all the background color is gone, until you see all the transparency right here. So. Uh, Make sure your quality is on pixelator or else it won't work. So once you're done that, you're okay. Um, now what uh, uh, you need to do is you're, you need to press control A again and go to effects. Uh, go to, uh, what is it? Uh, go to noise and go to median. And as you can see, it's really messed up right now. So. You can just drag this all the way down, play, with, play around with all the settings, make sure you have like, the most detailed sort. Um, yeah, I think this one's okay. Uh, you don't need to copy this down, just see whatever works with your settings. So, uh, just see which one works and which one doesn't work. And uh, yeah, so now we have a double resolution of level one. Uh, you can still do it your way, like your way of just like putting a pixel by pixel. This is just a new way I just found out. Um, I'm pretty sure this is not how the 32 faithful and the 64 faithful uh, people who made the texture packs did this way, but uh, did it this way. But yeah, uh, I don't think this works really well with 16 uh, bit swords i mean i think it messes up a lot so you guys might want to use a different uh resolution from 16 so uh yeah so now i'm gonna be showing you guys how to change the hoon saturation so uh you see this sword right here you know just no no nothing special about it right now uh, now what you're going to do is you're going to get your magic wand tool and make sure the tolerance is on 50 and uh, select uh, the parts that you want it to be uh, like recolored so you can just uh, it, like less tolerance means less selection uh, more tolerance means more selection so yeah but just play around until you get like the perfect one like this one looks like Nice. Um, this one looks pretty nice. Sorry. Um, and yeah, I just select the whole part, and now you can just go to your adjustments and go to Moon Saturation, uh, which is Control Shift U in your adjustments, and you can just play around with the Who, and, and you can change the color. So yeah, but, so let's just say you want like this to be a uh, greenish sword, just change it to that, and maybe you want to change the saturation so you, you don't want to see like this part of it, so, or opposite, uh, the lowest saturation gives you like a stone sword look, uh, go to the last one which gives you the brightest settings, and there's the lightness, but that only works well with like stone swords and iron swords uh so yeah uh so you can choose whatever you want i'll just choose this one so 
Yeah, uh, you guys pick what settings are good with you, and, uh, yeah. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, like, dip, it helped you, and, uh, see you guys later.